name is Tim. This video will be of interest to anyone who has a spreadsheet with monetary values that need to be converted to euros. LibreOffice has a conversion wizard for documents with amounts in old currencies of European countries, such as the French franc. You can convert one spreadsheet document or an, an entire directory of documents. The documents will be, will be saved to another directory. It also allows you to convert amounts in tables and fields of a text document. To be converted, documents need to be in open document formats. This video will show you how to set up documents for conversion, access the wizard, and the steps for converting documents. It will also show you the old documents before the conversion process and the documents that were converted. You can watch the video from beginning to end. If you are watching this video in a web browser on a computer, you can click on one of these links to my right and go to that section of the video. There will be a link throughout this video to return you to this point of the video where you can choose another item from the list. However, if you're watching through the YouTube app on a phone or tablet, you do not have this option. The first thing to do is convert documents to, to open document formats. If you have multiple documents in the same directory, you may want to use the document converter wizard. This link will take you to a video about the wizard. Otherwise, you need to convert one document at a time. I will save this spreadsheet, this Excel spreadsheet, that is an XLSX format to an ODS format. First, I open the document with LibreOffice. Then, I click on the File menu and choose the Save As item. When the Save dialog opens, I go to the File Type drop-down menu and select ODF Spreadsheet. Uh, next, I make sure that, that the directory from where you will select where I select the uh, documents convert is a uh, is that's where it's the directory it's set at. So I'm going to, and it is it, the spreadsheet dot German from directory is is the directory I want the uh, Euro converter wizard to choose documents from. So then I move on to the next step, which is uh, just click the save button and it. Uh, that saves as and creates a phone price ods document so I go ahead and I'll go ahead and just save this to be sure and we will move on to uh, properly setting up, up the document the next step is to make sure that cells in spreadsheets and text documents are converted to the correct currency format um, Let's look again at the spreadsheet about phones, where all, all the amounts are in German, the German Deutschmark. And you know, I've actually got the first two are are formatted properly, the others are not. So first, highlight all the cells that have amounts that need to be formatted as as a Deutschmark currency. So go ahead and highlight them. And press the right mouse button in this to pull up a menu. Then click on the Format Cells item in the list. This opens a Format Cells dialog. And in the Category column, select Currency. And then over in the Format, there's a drop down menu. And I slide up. Till I get to DEM DM German Germany. This is the Deutschmark. And so I select it. And if 
you want, you can at this point you can change the style of how the how the number um, is displayed. But I'm going to go ahead and just go to the next step and click OK, and this changes the other four columns into the Deutsch mark format. Um, you can do the same thing if if you have a text document and and these are in a cells in a table. It would be the same same process. So let me go ahead and save that, and we will move on to accessing the wizard. The URL converter wizard can be accessed through the file menu of the Start Center or the file menu of any one of the six applications. So to access it, you click the file menu, highlight the wizard submenu, and then highlight and select URL converter. This opens the URL converter wizard. In the wizard, choose whether you want to convert a single document or multiple documents. If you choose single, LibreOffice Calc document. This text box will be source document. If you choose sort complete directory, text box will be source directory. But step two is um, to choose the, the currency you want to convert from the drop-down menu, and since all my documents have the German currency, the Deutschmark, I would choose um, German mark in the drop down menu. So, <clears throat> next, click on the three dot button to access the open dialog to choose where you want uh, the wizard to uh, take documents from. So it, I'll choose this German dot from folder, and then um, the next step is you have three check boxes, include, including subfolders. Um, also convert fields and tables and text documents, and temporarily unprotect sh sheet with without query. So. Since that folder had uh, su subfolders in it, I'll ch choose including subfolders, and uh, I'll I have one text document with with the Deutschmark with the Deutschmark uh, field and in, in, fields and tables. So I'll go ahead and select that. Um, for target directory, that's where I want. The uh, new document set is created based on the conversion to be saved to. So I go ahead and uh, click click on the three dots to open the uh, open dialog, and I select this German two folder. So um, the next is uh, click the convert button, and it shows the progress of of converting three documents. And when it's finished, click the finish button.
I converted three documents. Here are the documents that the new documents were converted from. There's a phone spreadsheet, as you can see in the price column, Deutschmarks. There's a hotel spreadsheet, you can see in the cost per night, also Deutschmarks. And then there is a uh, text document and cost and with a, it has a table and in the cost column there's Deutschmarks and the cost per night also Deutschmarks. Here are the converted documents. As you can see the phone price and the price column they are now in euros And uh, for the hotel cost, cost per night, also in euros. And in the two columns in the table have also been converted to euros. This video was about the Euro Converter Wizard in LibreOffice. Thank you for watching. Click on the subscribe to OS College channel box and check out my other videos on YouTube.